Hey everybody, Kuzmos here, back again with Slay the Spire. We are going to do another special seed run. I'm going to do it with the Silent. Set the seed. Praise Sneko. Whoops, Sneko. Oh. The... Delete is a little overzealous here. I hope I got that right. And you can see on bottom left, it turns into another seed. There we go. All right. So I think the silent is usually a pretty good one for Sneko's eye. Let's do that. And just a regular attack since we don't have enough neutralized for it to actually last. And here, we can just do this. And discard for no real reason. Maybe. Now, obviously, there are a few kind of select things we might want to get. That is not a full block, so let's make it a full block. I could have done up just... I could have just killed him. Oh, well. My bad. We got him now and still haven't taken any damage. So... This now being a Sneko I run, we would like to get high cost cards. A particular, uh, let's say, premium card would be Bullet Time, since that would allow us to just discard you. Uh, that would allow us to just ignore all the increased costs. I mean, sure, that kind of breaks the idea, but hey. You know, Skewer can be nice, so I think I'll take it. And we'll start removing just regular old cards. There's like no rest around this way. We'll go up this route. Discard you. Um... Hit for a measly six damage. Okay, now here. Do that. that blocks everything. Yeah, skewer's nice because it will always function as advertised. No matter what, it's going to be 7x. 7 damage times x. I would say obviously, but is it obvious? I'm not sure. Let's see, so I, this way I can hit one, two shops, this way one, two, three, but, or not shops, fires. I think I like the fires for now. Do I like the fires that much? I don't know if I like the fires that much. Way more block than we need. Maybe I should have considered differently. Ugh, this is terrible. Uh, this is a great time for Gambler's Brew. Let's keep this skewer, though. If we can manage to like, block that with all zero costs, that would be golden. Alright. We managed to play some block. Let's just hit him. Because I don't feel we have any great options. We'll use our bad options. Or maybe, hopefully, less bad. Hopefully less bad. Alright, we've got enough block. Let's... Try to get you as close to it as we can. I mean, I prefer him to not debuff me at all. But barring that, you know, we can just kill you with that. And since he's not attacking, we don't have to block. Alright, so block with this, block here, and get a tiny bit more damage with that. Okay. We can just uh, get something decent here. Pretty certain I couldn't have killed him. It's a little hard to evaluate. Okay, now you're definitely dead. Just because, you know, I can't rely on the usual what cards cost sort of thing. Let's see, upgrade this. I will upgrade neutralize. I... will I? I think I should. Well, that's pretty nice. So that's a full defend, and a pretty hefty strike. 
And again, we can get a full defend for no cost. And do that. I might have actually been able to take him down. That's all right. We got him nonetheless. Okay. Flying knee is a maybe, but I don't. I don't think so. I mean, it kind of works with. Uh, with skewer, but not that great. Okay, bank of prep helps on our first turn. I guess I can make that better. Yeah, I should have went to the shops. I don't have much to upgrade. I guess I was hoping that something would come along. I'm just not getting the kind of things I feel I need. Alright, well that's nice. I think we're better off using the block potion on a turn. Like, I want to use the maximum amount of it. Rather than only 8 of the 12. Maybe that's nonsensical, but... Let's do this. And there we go. Fully blocking the much harder hit. And hoping... There we go, that's nice. We can take you out, so... With just one attack. So let's do just that. No reason to take extra damage just to do... Extra damage that's unnecessary. That again gets us full block. I think, you know, one of our main... Like, we want to get some regular strikes in here, but... Here we go. And we can actually kill you. Perfect. I mean, a, a lot of it's just defending until we can get Skewer out. Pretty much is what it is. Play that. Yeah, it's expensive. Yeah, I don't like it, but... We got him to the range where a fully charged Skewer will take him down. Do a tiny bit of damage and... Remove that, just in case. It might matter. Let's see. Block all the... All the things. Just waiting for our skewer. There it is. Yeah, I think, uh, previously, I kind of undervalued... You know? That could be good. Let's try it. Uh, I undervalued things like skewer on a Sneko run. Ah, uh, curse. Just... Worst time for a curse. All right, we got Amamori. Excellent. All right, we got this, and that's about it. Now I could have taken the energy potion. That might have been a good idea. So let's do it now. Um. There we go. One energy potion for a guaranteed win. I guess we upgrade that. Worst case scenario, it's three now for three later. And we probably wouldn't want to use it in that situation. Maybe we wouldn't have wanted to, maybe we shouldn't have used it here. We don't have a great way to use it. I mean, we can play everything. May have been a horrible mistake. Now, if I can get skewer now, oh boy. I'll use one of them for that, and then just boom, 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 just fly right past his changing point. Let's see, you can do this. One of these, and I think I will give him a few hits. Oh, that's pretty nice. Free block. And again, I'll take the extra damage in exchange for doing massive amounts of damage to him. We can play this, and yeah, just keep him from ever doing anything in that form, ever. I am perfectly fine with that. I think that's actually better to do it that way. And we can sneak a hit in there. I would have liked to have gotten out maneuver, but not really useful right now. And again, really. Oh, I've made a horrible mistake. Oh, he's only going to do 12 because he's weakened. Oh boy. But we've got to deal with him. Okay, he's not getting any damage through now. 
I should get a skewer next turn and win? Yes, I will. Okay. That was a little scary. Um, a little dangerous. Bullet time. There we go. More energy? Yeah, that seems a way to go. Yeah, bullet time just kind of lets us bypass a bad draw. Uh, yeah, bad draw as far as, like, what cards we get. And I like the excess energy. Like, here, it's not great. There we go. Full block. Let's get some energy for next turn. We won't have skewer. But hopeful. Oh, yes, we will. Okay. That is a wonderful, wonderful combo. Leg sweep seems a great way to block. Much better than a puny little block for five. Okay, let's hit with this. Do an outmaneuver. I should have probably just straight up attacked. Because I would have killed him outright. Yeah, that was a little mistake. That's alright. We'll survive it. And I can just eliminate you, right? I don't get to draw. Let's not take any damage from you. And I guess also kill you. Backstab, not great in this, our situation. Oh, this is just beautiful, though. Alright, I'm going to weaken you for eternity and play billions of block for no reason whatsoever. Seems a useful thing to do, right? Sure of it. Got enough block, let's not stuff anything back here. Got plenty of energy. Alright, so... Hit you with that. That's there. And, oh! I made a mistake. I did not account for being weakened. That cost me. Okay, let's eliminate you. Get another card draw. That's great. I think that's worth it. Um, yeah, we've got all the block we need, so let's stop playing them. Do that. And hit you a couple times. If I can get luck and get skewer this turn. That would be nice. I think we play that and hope. We're trying to minimize the plays we make. Because they hurt. Um. I mean, I mean they're costing us. Over here, you know? Alright, 15, that's not great. I think I will make these plays. Because we're not doing maximum damage. He's doing a ton to us. We should really consider our strength. Oh dear. Yeah, we should consider that. Consider this. Um. It's already weakened. Oh, I've made a horrible mistake. I did not account for him already being weakened. Alright, let's get extra energy for next turn. And that's it. Please, please give me a skewer. You did not give me a skewer. But, I can block everything. I mean, by stuffing tons of daces. Can I, I can take him down. Okay. Wow. This, this run is not going well for me. Is there anything I can do to improve this? I don't have any discards. That's not that great. Um, move some regular block. Throw some dash in there. Okay. If I can get through here, I'll be fine. Let's make that weakness last as long as possible. We have no more attacks that we can do there, so... Uh, well, you know, I would... 
almost prefer to do this differently, but on the other hand, being able to block most everything, not enough of everything. Okay, can we finish you off? Yes, we can. Okay. Now we need 17 block. Let's just be sure we've got it. I think we might be dead here. I'm very uncertain of our ability to survive this. Yeah, we're dead. Alright. Let's take one more time to try to get the praise Sneko running. I mean, yeah, I'm obviously trying to force it. I'm... Oh, I... You know what? It doesn't matter what we choose. Just whatever. I'm just going to abandon run. I don't know if that'll affect... A regular run, that's okay. I'll just make a run through and deal with the consequences of that. That was my bad. Alright, so praise, uh, pra praise Sneko. Got it that time. Should probably have those on like where I can copy them nice and easy. So let's see what we can put together. Okay, we've got defense covered. And I guess you're done. That's not great, but hey, it's something. Yeah, the first turn, or like the first fight or two with Sneko is usually a bit rough. Just because you don't have like anything other than your basic cards, which are just sucking under Sneko, mostly. Oh, I like this. Again, we'll lose the max HP. Um, is there anything I really want to upgrade? Let's, let's take a relic and hope... Dang it. Alright, go away. Now I can't afford anything. What if, like, blind... You know, actually, blind would have not been a great choice. So, I'm fine of not having not gotten it. I guess I'll upgrade this just so that if we do get a chance to use it, at least it lasts. And I need to get into some fights so I can actually get things. Because as is, we don't have any cards. We, we need uh, skills, obviously, would be a very prime choice for us. Let's see if we can't eliminate one of you. Or weaken, of course, so it doesn't go as far as I'd like. Yeah, this is just uh, some rough Sneko luck I'm getting here. Usually, Sneko just cleans things up. But then again, we don't have a deck designed for Sneko yet. We're trying to, but it's just not working for us. I feel like it's mostly just me skipping cards that would normally be perfectly fine to have. At least we've got a nice starting turn where we can just boom, boom, boom. Don't mind paying for that. I would have liked to have played one of those. Need to be a little more attentive to my costs. Just play this. That and that. He's virtually guaranteed to die. Ah, and you know, Dash. Dash is a definitely a good play for us. And let's get some... Really nothing there? Just straight cost? Okay, fine. Dash will be a great upgrade target. Uh, great card in general. Let us weaken you and... I Yes, put you just right on the bare edge of dying. So, I can strike you with this, then dash, and then not care about everything else. I'm going to assume I can probably block everything, and I can if I just don't attack. That'll give time for our vulnerability to wear off. 
And okay, that went quite well. You don't skewer once again. But I think dash is a lovely little play. Could actually make gains on it. As far as the actual cost goes, I guess we'll weaken him for a turn. And well, that's not great, but hey, we got block. So that's nice. Let's play that. After all, it's feeling that a free block is a bad idea. There's not much else we could have done, really. Let's go ahead and get a little more block. Yeah, right, we spend everything to cast a dash. That was probably not the best of ideas. If I do this, that is... 21 damage, not quite enough to kill him. If I do this... A little of that... That blocks almost all the damage. And we should be able to kill him this turn? Not really. Goodness. At least reduce what we're taking. Man, we're doing good on this fight at first, but it just kind of petered out there for a bit. Setup is tempting, but I don't think it works properly with Sneko's Eye, or not how we want it to with Sneko's Eye, I should say. It's hard to say for sure what proper is. We get one of those, that's nice. Almost get him dead. We're close to guaranteed to be able to take him down. Though this would be the time when we're not. So very close, just not enough strikes that we could actually cast. It's only possible to hit one of them. Okay. Now you are so very dead. I mean, I thought Outmaneuver might be a good option last time, but... I don't really feel that it... did a good job for us. We have really few cards. That's remarkable how few cards we have. Alright. We pop this and one of these. At least we avoided some of the damage. I don't really feel we had any great upgrade targets, so... Not concerned about losing out on that. Now we've got to block all the damage for free. That's always a lovely bonus. One damage for free, I'll take it. And I think... Oh, I should pay attention to how much block I already had. That was a gigantic waste. But it's quite alright. Get a little weakness on him. Alright, we've got a defend here. And I think our best option is just attacking. Because it'd be silly to defend when he's not really attacking. I'm not even certain why I feel the need to say that. Obvi it's kind of obvious, right? Okay, we can accept this damage. Not be happy about it, but we can accept it. Now, this turn, we need to do something. I mean, Mind Blasting is a good option. Hitting him as much as we can is also a good option. We survive with, what, 6 points? 18. I uh, miscalculated a little bit. Or mis didn't pay proper attention. Let's go ahead and discard this. And block more than is necessary. Why do that? That doesn't do us any good. However, this does quite well for us. Um, hmm, no. We have two cards from our deck. Uh, maybe a little healing could help us get past. Because, man, things are just not coming up for us. Alright, let's go ahead and just hit one of you. And prevent you from upping your strength because it's such a gigantic pain. We also didn't really need to shackle him, but... I mean, why let him 
do things, right? Oh, this is the one we want. That should block all the damage. We've knocked another out of the air. Now, we don't have quite the sorts of attacks we need to knock everybody out. Like, just to keep them out of the air entirely. That's pretty good, though. So, he's going to get a strength up. But I think he'll be easy to knock down. Probably, yes. Alright, and take you down. Defend for no reason. Alright, so he'll hit a little harder. But... He has over cost but it killed him, so... I'm not getting any of the high cost cards I really want. I don't want bites, thank you very much. Alright, a little of this. One of those. More than enough blocks, so at least there's that. Uh, if we can manage to knock down his shields, that'd be lovely. Alright, a little bit of progress on that. Obviously, the more we knock down his shields, the more effective we are. And if we can knock him all the way down, of course, we get a free stun, which is nice. Let's do that. More shield knocking. And a full block. I think we've pretty much got him dead to rights. Especially with a hand like that. Goodness. I think we would have just about played the whole thing. Okay, give me something worthwhile. Anything, please. That's nothing I really want. Increase your max life? Yeah, why not? We don't seem to be getting anything else. We could have went that way and got some... Lovely, lovely... Um... Things, free healings and upgrades and all that. But no, no, we're fine. We're fine, we don't need that. Let's do 30 damage to him and block 5 of his 12. I mean, it's not the greatest thing, but... It's something, right? This is not... Oh, no, this. I like. I mean, he still hits us like a bloody truck. Very, very painful truck. That's probably enough to keep me alive and taking minimal damage. At least we can block all of this one. We need one good solid round. Uh, this is not it. And this is actually probably us dead. That just did not come together for us either time. Nonetheless, I do hope you enjoyed the attempts. If you did, be sure to leave a like and let me know what you think in the comments. But, uh, until next time, catch you later.